everyone, my name is Greg and this is your tarot reading for Tuesday the 2nd of December 2014. Thank you for joining me today, it's wonderful to be with you as always. And I've got my tarot cards here, I've got my tarot of the animal lord. I'm just shuffling the cards and I'm going to see what's coming up for you on this day and what you'll be working with. So, let's have a look. Okay, wonderful. The first card is a reversed flamingo, and this is temperance. And temperance is all about uh, balance. And it's about balance between spirit and the physical world. And it's in reverse. And what that means is you're a little bit overly emotional this morning, and you're focused on your feelings rather than what's really happening. So if someone's upset you, really get some perspective back in there and see what's really occurred and um, if you're not possibly being a little bit overly sensitive. That's what I'm getting a lot in the morning. As the day progresses, I see you getting on top of your own feelings again and getting um, a sense of balance and overcoming difficult emotions. So yeah, I, I really do get that, that there's a sense of overreaction in the morning. But as the day goes on, you're actually able to bring that back. And then finally, the Knight of Chalices. The Knight of Chalices is about taking actions around your feelings. It's about loving, being loving, being kind and being caring towards other people. So you learn something emotionally about yourself, about other people on this day, and you're really able to integrate that into your own being to give you more compassion for others, to give you a greater emotional understanding and greater emotional intelligence. You know, people who suffer in life are often much more, well, always much more compassionate than people who've never had a difficult day in their life. And of course, I mean, I'm talking in extremes here. Everyone has their own problems. Everyone has their kind of things that they have to deal with. But people have really, you know, been through difficult things in life, but often the most open hearted people and often the most resilient people. And your overreaction in the morning, it, you kind of get an insight into that. And you're like, okay, well, that's my part in the situation. And this is why things sometimes happen like that, because I tend to overreact and escalate them or, you know, underreact, something like that. And you, become, you get that insight and it helps you to be more open-hearted and loving. Let's look at these numbers. We've got the 14 here. 14, 15, 16. And that's 7 in numerology. 1 and 6 is 7. And 7 is mind. Use your mind and understand your mind. And realize what you're thinking, what your behavior, what your feelings have to do with situations you know no man is an island and you have certain character traits that then influence other people so you really get a deep insight into what it is you contribute to situations on this day it's quite a um, humbling day that's what I feel you know I don't think you're gonna be eating humble pie or anything but it's like okay well I do tend to get a little bit angry or I do tend to criticize or I do burst into tears when things aren't even that terrible, or I do sulk. You know, it's something like that. And once you realize that about yourself, it's so freeing and it's so liberating. It's like once you have that knowledge, it can be power and you can do something about it then. And if you can't do anything about it, there's always spirit and you can always rely on spirit to help you and you can say, God, I realize I've been sulking for 30 years and I have no idea how I'm going to change this. Please help me. And that's all you need to do to get help, really. <laughs> and that's the great thing about our universe, that we do get that help when we ask for it. So I hope you have a wonderful day. Please subscribe to my channel. If you'd like a private reading with me, then um, please visit my website. It's gregoryscott.com. And you can also send me an email. The address is readings at gregoryscott.co.uk. Have a great day and I'll speak to you tomorrow. I'm using the Radiant Rider weight deck for this reading. Let's see what's coming up. Okay. Well